Hello again and welcome to my allotment. Uh, today I'm at Croft. Uh, I've got two, well, I've got three plots, two at Croft, one at uh, Broughton. And this is the very start of my allotment. It, as, you, as you can see, I've got it all fenced in on the side and I've put netting on the top. Um, this is kind of ickety pickety area. I've got a few kohlrabi, cabbages, um, all around the circumference are soft root brushes. So I've got raspberries, gooseberries, um, oh, what we got? Um, black currants, red currants, etc. Over this area here, which is also mine, it's all potatoes. All the way down to that white uh, fleece down there, which I've got covering my earlies. Moving across, I've got a nice pear tree just there, which uh, has got had loads of blossom there, and it was only transplanted uh, about six weeks ago from the adjoining plot. And over here, we have got uh, just over there. That's gooseberries. We've got blackberry. More gooseberry down here. The mixture of green and red. Um, blackberry over there. Uh, another blackberry there. And then moving on here, here are, here's just a few of my raspberry canes. And just over there, we've got the rhubarb. Uh, five lots, uh, which is, as you can see, it's flourishing. Um, that's the polytunnel. Um, the polythene sheeting's been kept up all year, all winter, and it, it, and it's, despite the gales, it, it stayed up. And that's basically through these guy ropes I've got uh, over the top, and uh, it's done the job. Now over here, we've got my strawberries. These were planted in um, oh, when were these March, I believe. It was in that warm spell, and you can see they're uh, developing nicely now. I think there's uh, 84 there. There's a mixture of early's, mains, and lates. And then when we walk across here, you can see that. <laughs> Look at how they're, they're almost touching some of those strawberry plants. Um, these were all planted last autumn, and uh, as I showed you in one of the earlier videos, you know, I think you can probably see that they're all growing nicely. I've actually filled in, I lost half a dozen and I filled those in. So they're going nicely. And then down at the bottom there, we've got my shed. We've got my little flower borders on both sides, my picnic table. And and then, well, if we walk along my path here, come all along here, and then at the end of my shed, I've got this area here. And basically, um, the council's putting up chicken wire, um, rabbit proof fencing around there, and uh, that'll give me this area, this area, all around here. And the plan is that uh, that's where I'll we'll be keeping the chickens uh, when I eventually get some. And that's it. So that's, if we look up here, you can basically see my plot, both my plots, that one there, the main one. And uh, just having a quick whiz around, you can see that uh, a couple of plots across, the chap there, he. Uh, all he keeps is birds on his. He's got uh, a mixture of um, hens, uh, ducks, geese, turkeys. He's basically got the lot there. I don't know where you can make out, but there's a cockerel there. And his plot goes right the way up to the top there. It's about 220 foot long. And that's it. Thank you for watching.